welcome back or welcome to my channel if you're new here if you are new here hey what's up my name is Danny and welcome to vlogmas week two if you guys haven't already seen vlogmas week one definitely go make sure to watch that one before you watch this one just so you can be caught up on how I'm structuring vlogmas this year and who I am where I am all that good stuff but I'm really excited to have you guys here whether you're new to my channel or not and if you are new, make sure to subscribe because there's going to be so much fun content coming to my channel this month and in 2020, and I want you to be part of all of it. I'm actually kicking off this week in my life on Wednesday. I normally do this when I start vlogging at school because Mondays and Tuesdays are usually my busiest days. And I don't mean busy in the sense where there's lots of good vlog footage. I mean busy in the sense where I'm either cooped up in my room and editing videos or on campus all day doing schoolwork. So there's really nothing fun to see there, but I think from here, I mean, from today until Sunday, it's gonna be a really, really good week, and I'm excited to kind of take you guys through my college life. I'm gonna be heading out in a little bit. I'm actually going to urgent care, not for myself, for my roommate, Madeline. She's been sick for a little bit, and it's about time that she goes to urgent care, and I promised I would go with her, and then we're probably gonna end up heading off to campus because I have lots and lots of work to do. So even though this week isn't technically finals week, this kind of feels more like finals week than next week will because I am an advertising major. If you didn't know and because of that especially since i'm in my senior year i really don't have too many exams it's kind of just big projects and it's this week that all of those projects are kind of wrapping up but before i head out i want to show you guys some things i recently got in the mail if you guys watched the last vlogmas vlog then you would know that i made a very impulsive order on glossier and all the stuff came in the mail the other day and i'm obsessed so i want to just show you guys really quickly what i got please hold so just as a little reminder, I got three products because they were doing a little bundle sale and it was such an amazing deal. So the first product that I got is their Lash Slick. I've never used this before and I'm wearing it right now and I'm freaking obsessed with it. I don't want to give a final, final review because I've only worn it about, I guess, two times at this point, but so far I love it. But as for a product that I know I can say that I love, I love Boy Brow so much. I've gone through like five, six tubes of this thing. It's like my favorite product that they sell. So I, of course, had to get another refill of this one. And last but not least, I got one of their cloud paints. This is in the shade Haze. I also did want to mention to you guys that last night I did end up going out with a few of my friends. You guys will recognize some of the names. I went out with Liz and Anna, who I studied abroad with. Obviously, some of you guys love my study abroad vlogs, so you guys would definitely recognize their face. And we had a really, really good night, but when we were leaving the bar, it actually snowed for the first time this season, which is super exciting, especially because, like I just said, I studied abroad last semester. And even though it was cold, when we got to Spain in January, it didn't snow at all. So I haven't seen snow, not since last December, but the December before that, because it didn't even snow before I left for study abroad. So that was really exciting. And it was just overall a really good night. It's always nice just going out with them because they're a lot of fun. I just, I have really good friends here at the school and I feel really, really lucky. Also, before I head out, I'll show you guys my outfit. I recently bought this sweatshirt at Urban Outfitters, and I love it so much. I've been wanting this for a really long time, actually, and I'm so happy I finally bit the bullet and got it. It's actually not even that expensive. I'm pretty sure this was only $44 and totally worth it, so much so that I might go back and get another color. I'm wearing these jeans that I always wear and always get so many questions on, and they're from Zara. And then I'll probably just put on my Air Force Ones. What else is new? Happy vlogging. Here we go. eating our acai bowls and going to urgent care. Unfortunately, we have no updates when it comes to <laughs> Madeline because she's now been to two doctors and no one knows what's wrong with her. This time they literally just gave her nasal spray and symptom reliever and they were like, have fun. Wow, my mouth is so purple. We need to fix this before we go to campus. <laughs> this is embarrassing. <laughs> oh my God. And I have stuff in my teeth, goddamn. Um, anyway, we're gonna head over to campus now. We have class in like an hour and a half or so but I have work to do, and police investigation, 2.3 miles away. Bye! I'm <laughs> Going back driving. to New York, bye! I'm literally driving us back. <laughs> Yay! 
it's 9 40 now and i got out of my last class around 40 minutes ago i have lots and lots of night classes that's basically how i pull off having a mainly a tuesday wednesday thursday schedule but primarily tuesday thursday it's amazing not having classes on mondays and fridays and i was able to get the same exact schedule for next semester which is incredible because i'm actually going to be traveling a lot next not a lot but like i'm going to be traveling more than usual next semester and that schedule is definitely ideal but now that i'm home i have a lot of work to do i want to try and set you guys up on here so i don't have to the camera um now that i'm home i still have a lot of work to do for starters i have to edit a video not actually for youtube but for school um, i'm in a documentary production class and it is my job to edit said documentary so i have to get this done it doesn't have to be done by tomorrow thank god but i do have to have something i also just made a little non-dinner like this can't even really count as dinner but i barely have any food in the apartment so i made these mini chicken tacos from trader joe's that are actually quite good and i'm ready to bang out all of this work so i'll get this done and then i'll talk to you guys tomorrow good morning everybody and happy thursday i'm definitely getting a little bit of a later start today than i normally do on thursdays usually since i mean as some of you guys might know tuesday thursdays are my really big class days i spend pretty much all day on campus and although today's not going to be much of an exception i'm still going to be on campus all day i'm normally out of the apartment by like 9 30 the latest and right now it's already 11 and i just decided to take some time to myself i had to work on that video project that i told Told you guys about yesterday and then i had to respond back to some emails i got a really exciting email yesterday and um it's, it hasn't even been like 12 hours and things have escalated quite a bit i never really vlog in my living room ever but i did want to show you guys some of the christmas decorations that my roommate laura put up i guess we can start in this room which is my favorite room in the apartment it's just like our little sun room i guess but also where we eat our meals she has this little candle right here and a wreath i guess we have cute little decorations on the windowsill some snowflakes on the window that one fell We'll figure that out later. And then out here, obviously we still have the same fairy lights that we've had since the beginning of the year. But out on our coffee table, we have this little Christmas tree. She put these little statues down here. I think she got all of these decorations from her grandma. And then, of course, we have a Christmas tree. And just to tie it all together, I feel like this might be a really nice touch also. I just love how our apartment looks so much. Super homey. And it's making me just want to stay on this couch all day and watch a Christmas movie. But I cannot do that, so I'm going to go get my stuff together and head off for campus. All right, guys, clearly it's a little while later. I feel like this is always a trend, especially on Thursdays. I don't vlog all day because I'm on campus. And then by the next time that I talk to you, it is like, what time is it right now? Almost 10 o'clock and I'm ready to go out. This is actually our last Thursday of the semester, which is super weird because I don't know, just like everything that we label as the last is super weird because we're seniors, but it's gonna be a really good night. We're going back to a bar that we always went to when we were under 21. <laughs> and it was like, it's a big freshman thing, I guess. And uh, it's just kind of weird to be going back as a senior. I'll show you guys my outfit in this mirror rather than outside because it's super dark in my room. I'm wearing this long sleeve top from Urban Out. Why is it so exposed? Hello? Please hold. Hi, I'm wearing this black long sleeve top from Urban Outfitters. I got it recently and they have it in a bunch of different colors and I kind of am obsessed with it. So I think I'm gonna buy a few more of them. And then I'm just wearing regular black jeans from Topshop and I think it's per usual. And then I'm drawing some more jewelry. <laughs> everyone and happy Saturday. I didn't end up vlogging yesterday because I wasn't really doing anything during the day and then I last minute decided to go out with these two and Liz. <laughs> 
decided to go out with them last night too. What was supposed to be an ugly Christmas sweater party, I didn't have one of those, so I just wore like a green sweatshirt that my friend Liz lent me, but it was a lot of fun. I'm happy I ended up going. But today's actually going to be a very big day because we're going to DC to celebrate Brooke's birthday a little bit early because none of us are actually gonna be in Baltimore for her birthday, so we decided to get on it a little early and it's gonna be a lot of fun. But we are keeping the tradition going and we're going to Dunkin' this morning. This is what we always do after we go out together and today will be no exception. So, gotta get my shit together and then we're gonna get some <sighs> All right, just made it back from Dunkin' with very little time to spare, so I just changed into my outfit. Really, really simple. My jacket is from Princess Polly. Shirt is from Bershka, I believe. I got it when I was abroad. My fanny pack is from Brandy Melville. I always get so many questions on this thing, so it is from Brandy Melville. My jeans are from Topshop, and the same shoes that I wear all the freaking time. <laughs> God, this Baltimore view. Guys, we just got to the train station, and there is a man standing there with a sign that says, will you marry me? Her family's standing over there recording. Oh my God, oh my God. I can't, I can't, I can't, I'm literally gonna freak out. I can't. Oh my God, stop. Is it happening? Yes. Oh my, oh my God. Oh my God. Congrats. Congratulations. <laughs> We're sitting at brunch right now, and we just realized that we all look like we're part of an Apple investment meeting. We all look like Steve Jobs. It just wasn't planned. It was not. What do you mean all girls dress the same? I have yeah. no idea what you're talking about. Alright guys, we finished brunch a little while ago. That food was so good. I haven't been this full in such a long time time i didn't even end up getting a drink at that place because i just couldn't handle all that was going on but now we're walking over no, no, well, in order to <laughs> exactly i'm one behind it's fine and now in order to comp over what am i trying to say and now in order to compensate for does that make sense okay and now in order now in order to compensate for all that food that we just ate we're doing a 45 minute walk <laughs> to a bar <laughs> <laughs> We're doing a 45 minute walk to a place that is supposed to have these huge mules. Madeline and Laura have already been, and I've you've been, been right? Yeah, oh my god. So big. I really, really want to go. It's like the size of Danny, literally. I, I'm going to be able to like, fit inside the mule. ran that fast in my life ever. I have problems uh, with time management. I know. <laughs> it's bad. <laughs> 